Are you kidding? Like, I haven't processed that this is our house. This is so weird. I like. I have not processed it yet. Like, what the fuck? I'm shook. Like, I, like leaving our house like was sad, but like you forget just how incredible it is here. And this is an apple tree. Like, that is I have everything. My apples and just. I don't eat fruit. Why did I say that? But it, I, it is everything. I am excited. No. Well, no, you run when you get down there. Is this a bad idea? Yeah, my heart's starting to pound. He's yeah, even saying, little, I don't think I want to use the harness. I don't even know what the harness is. I'll try it without the harness. Oh my gosh, Shane. <laughs> He's going to do it without the okay, harness. So, I know you get all nervous about these things. This is not good. Yeah. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm nervous. Don't go down, make sure he doesn't fall. Okay. <laughs> well, no, you run when you get down there. All right. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! I walked up into my grandma's room, there's Bella, and look at this. Honey, what the heck? That is cat food. No, no. Okay, everybody, we've made it to Colorado, as you can see. We're at my parents' house. Oh, there's my dad. <laughs> so, the plan is, well, tonight, oh my gosh, tonight, we're going to see the house for the second time, because we've only ever seen it when we fell in love with the house, and now we've just been fantasizing through pictures in the video. So, the plan for today is, first, we're gonna go furniture shopping. We found a restoration hardware outlet that we're so excited about. And then tonight, the owners slash our real estate agent are throwing, like, a happy hour or bash at the new house where we're gonna meet the owners. I guess you guys will meet the owners too. And I don't even know if we've told them, but we then found out they're also a gay couple, which is kind of crazy. Don't buy erase me. What? Huh? Oh, sorry, Shane's by. <laughs> um, well, they're a gay couple, so I'm excited. We're, this is gonna be like kind of overwhelming, but exciting. So let's go. Wow, that didn't sound very exciting for moving to a different state. Are you excited? <laughs> I'm really excited. <laughs> yeah, we got all kinds of to do things. <laughs> I mean, I'm. What? All these are to do lists. Oh, this is. <laughs> he printed out our inspection report. You marked things? Every one of them needs to be addressed. So they sent the inspection report, and Shane and I were both like, uh, so I forwarded it to my dad, and this is what happened. Yeah, we've got some things to do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'll go furniture shopping. Well, we're gonna go furniture shopping. <laughs> I also want to say, I am very excited. I'm like overstimulated, I think, just from the move and like so much happening, but I'm very, very excited. Yeah, the furniture store, if they have an electrical plug, we need to plug up your service panel because there's moss in there. Oh. Okay, great, <laughs> well, got it. Fun. See? Okay, so <laughs> we do have a mission and we called every restoration hardware outlet out there and we fell in love with Boucle. Like, how would you describe it, Shane? Uh, it's, um, I think I just turned off the camera. Did I just turn off the camera? No, okay, sorry. Ugh, okay, sorry, no, stop. Uh, it is literally like a big teddy bear laying out asking you to sit on its face. So, which is kind of our relationship. So, I just want that. I'm really excited. It will be a big, uh, what's the word? statement accent piece? I was gonna say uh, it will probably be a big mistake. We're probably gonna be embarrassed by it. And I just wanna continue to make really bad design choices <laughs> so that hopefully at some point, like a design YouTuber will like do a reaction to our house and go, Ugh! Oh <laughs> yeah, recently we've kind of went down the rabbit hole of a man named Arvin. Hi everyone, my name is Arvin Olano and nobody asked, but welcome to my updated home tour. Like him a lot. And we've discovered that boucle is all the rage. Boucle, now. <sighs> By the way, if you don't know what boucle is, when I saw this trend happening, I was like, boucle, that's literally the kind of like street furniture we used to get when I was a kid. Like the free furniture on the side of the road was always boucle couches. And I'd always be like, oh, I don't know, mom. It looks like it has rats in it. But we'd be like, well, it's cheaper than big lots. So the fact that it's like a trend now, Apparently, everybody on YouTube hates boucle. I'm shook. Yeah. 
it's pretty shaky. <laughs> okay, here's the outlet mall. Cute. All right, we made it to the Restoration Hardware outlet. Cute. They have the chandelier Shane loves right in the entryway. Oh my gosh, another one. Wow, a suede cloud. Kind of iconic. I don't love how it feels, but oh. the color. Wow. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Okay, blue boucle chair moment. I don't think the silver goes with our houses, like farmhouse vibe. See, I think it's cute, but it just reminds me of like when I used to really wear down my furniture when <laughs> I was a kid. Like, <laughs> Yeah, or like after Cheeto scratches it a million times. Or my pants after my chub rub. Like, <laughs> you know, you guys get it. Okay, we snapped. Like literally that outlet store snapped for us. <laughs> Couldn't have been better case scenario. The desk. I was like, oh, I want this desk when we were looking at the website for the Colorado house. It's like an, a wooden oak desk that's gorgeous. And I was like, oh, that's very like mountain chic. And then I just kept finding beautiful, like I found velvet armchairs that are so gorgeous. So the vibe for my new office, I've just coined as grounded glam. Like, <laughs> What is that? <laughs> You're laughing, but I couldn't be more serious. It's like, I want it to be like down to earth neutrals, but also feel super glamorous. And I think I found the perfect pieces to mesh all of those things together. And now I'm so excited because it will be the podcast room. It will be my office and I'm going to feel so creatively inspired. Last thing I'll say, I know I'm talking a lot. Uh, Shane found this beautiful, like royal blue. What would you call it? Um, an awards cabinet that has gold hardware. Oh, once I get an impressions vanity mirror, you guys are gonna be shaking because I'm shaking. So office renovations coming soon. I'm so excited. Who would have thought I could get so excited from furniture shopping? Well, everybody, me. literally <laughs> everyone watching. <laughs> I was shocked to no one. Oh man. Okay, so now I gotta go shower, and we're going to meet the owners, the previous owners of our house. Crazy. Okay, we're going, we're headed to the house. Like the first time it's technically ours because we've closed today. So this is very fun because they're hosting us, which is exciting. We're having like a happy hour. And it seems like a lot of people are coming because like my family, the realtor's family, the owner's family. So like a lot of people. It's It sounds like my nightmare, but honestly, I'm so excited about the house and I'm so excited to meet the owners that I'm just putting that aside for right now. I have a Diet Coke, like I feel good. Like I'm ready. We're ready to party. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I'm nervous. It feels different now that like it's ours. Yeah. What if we pull up to it and we hate it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't think that's possible. <laughs> oh my God. We haven't seen it at night before. What if at night we're like, wait, we hate it. Oh God. What if we change our mind? <laughs> I don't know. I think it's going to be great. I'm very excited. Oh my God. Ugh. I can't zoom in, but there's llamas. They have llamas. I'm like... I'm like getting nervous again. I'm so nervous. I don't know why. Like I wasn't five seconds ago when we were filming. Look at but... the horsey. Oh my God. Oh. oh my God. Okay. Okay. I don't regret living here now. Oh my God. Look at the horsey. Oh my God. I can't believe we're doing this. I'm freaking out. Look at how it turned into like the mountains all of a sudden. When it snows, oh my God. It's gonna be gorgeous. It's so incredible because we're so close to civilization, but it feels like you're in a different world. Like it feels like we're going to our mountain house. Oh my God, it's coming up. There's oh my right God, first. oh my God, wait. What the fuck did we do? Oh my God, I'm scared. Wait. Okay, we're turning on to our street. Oh my God. Oh my oh God. Oh my God. Oh, Austin just pulled right into their driveway. Look how many people are here. Oh, there's so many people. What's oh going on? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Wow. Wait, I'm so scared. People We've are dressed up. Into the Who are these before? people? Wait, I'm scared. Oh my gosh. Oh, the owners are coming right for oh, us. Wait, what do we do? What do we do? I think I'm just gonna park right here. Oh, it's like a grinder hookup <laughs> that I paid for. Okay. Oh. I got the right rig for the farm. Nice to meet you. Nice I'm gonna give you a hug. Oh, oh yay! Oh, 
know. I'm so happy. Of everybody that could have bought it. Thank you yeah. so much. Of course. Thank you for giving <laughs> it a little more. Hey, how are you? Hey, how are you? Nice to meet you. 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 Nice to meet you
That's all. Yeah, this is what I was uh, mentioning to Shane. When you guys were showing your video and showing the house, it was felt very vulnerable to us. Yeah. Like, oh my God, what if they see something like, oh, that sucks, and like, oh God, it's something no. that we really like. And the fact that you guys were so kind and so gracious about the whole house, we wanted you guys to be the one to get it. Oh. And we were working behind the scenes trying to like change fate so that you guys would be the owners of the farm. And we love that you're going to keep the name, the farm. Oh, oh yeah. Of course. That's, what's your favorite part of the house? Like, what are you sad to leave? The hot tub. We, we sit out there, you know, kids are gone, so it's, it's clothing optional hot tub. <laughs> we sit out there and we watch the stars yeah. and we watch the fountain and we watch the little foxes and the the mother and her twin fawns and oh, yeah. it's every night it's a magical yeah. place for you guys to just relax at the end of the day just, just, i don't know it's it's our peaceful country home you know one thing he has talked about was um the possibility of raising children here and coming back to your family and being close to your family who by the way are freaking amazing we had so much fun with your family uh is you know, Christian, how old were you when you when we moved into the house? I was 15 when we moved here. Christian, you have a lot of memories of growing up on the farm. Share those with Ray and Shane. <laughs> no pressure. No pressure. No pressure. Yeah. Well, I think more than anybody, <laughs> Christian enjoyed the farm the yeah. most, at least the outside part. I will be honest, I was I was pretty sad when they told me they were going to sell it. Because it was just like, this was so much fun here. Mowing this lawn took day. forever, but it was really <laughs> rewarding when you look at it afterwards. Um, just had a lot of fun, especially because she was raised here as a puppy. She like started out here. Wow. Um, and so it was really fun having that experience with the dog out here. It was like our own little secret paradise. The so sunsets it was are awesome. incredible. We have a zip line underneath the lights and But you guys gotta go on tonight. So <laughs> I would love to like get you guys on the zip line. Uh I'll you can get him on it. I'll go for sure. Okay, I'll show to do it. Let's it's, do it's, it. it's pretty cool. right. okay. Wait, right now? Yep. We're, 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 we're gonna go on the zip line, Mom. Okay, so what we used to do was that we would jump into the water. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So you're feeling brave. You need to run out. You're going to hit a block, and so it's going to be like, boom. So you want to, yeah, you kind of want to. You get a ladder, you get tied Please don't die. I get, it's like, I feel like I don't want to live here alone. Like it's, yeah. it's something I have to do though. Like there's no option at this point. Because I don't have the option. Oh, I can be over oh, here. Oh, yeah. Is this a bad idea? Yeah. I ain't doing that. I don't think Ryan should and he doesn't want to use the harness. I'll try it without the harness. Oh my gosh, Shane. <laughs> He's going to do it without the okay, harness. So, I know you get all nervous about these things. This is not good. Yeah. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! I can't believe you did it without a harness though. I they made it sound like it was the most challenging endeavor. It was pretty good. It's like sky. It was everything. Do you wanna do it? Uh no. I like watching. Are you kidding? I haven't processed that this is our house. This is so weird. I like, I have not processed it yet. Like what the I'm fuck? I'm shook. Like, I, like leaving our house like was sad, but like you forget just how incredible it is here. And this is an apple tree. Like, that is I have everything. My apples and just. I don't eat fruit, why'd I say that? But it, I, it is everything, I am excited. No, this is incredible. So good. Now what are you gonna do about it? I just snuck inside because I have to go to the bathroom. And we haven't been inside yet. This is crazy. Oh my god. My favorite bathroom! Wow, that looks like a painting. Yeah. With all those trees. Wow. Oh, I think you're gonna love it here. You're not gonna want to go to California. <laughs> no. <laughs> Did you see the kitchen? No, I just. Oh wait, your that. brother hasn't seen it yet, right? No, he has. Yeah, oh, Austin hasn't seen it yet. Not that he good. wants to be vlogged, probably, <laughs> but. Making memories at the farm already, Shane. <laughs> coming in hot. <laughs> Thank you.
we're looking at the marble? That's as thick as I've ever seen. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right here. <laughs> All right. Come on, Austin. Three, two, one. Lift your feet up. So, where's my room? <laughs> I'm looking at like you're out of my parents' house. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, you can have the guest barn. Yeah. Also, I think maybe uh, you need a boat. A boat? I want to get a little paddle boat. Like a tiny one. <laughs> oh, like a canoe? <laughs> <laughs> no, like, you haven't seen them? They're like really... They you paddle oh, like a... Like the ones at the reservoir. Oh, with your, and you can keep your clothes on. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Okay, so now that we have the house, we have to thank Jessica because it couldn't have happened without her, honestly. And so if you're looking for a house in Colorado, Jessica, I'll put her information below. Everyone needs Brad. Everyone was joking in the comments that it was definitely sponsored by Brad. That's me. <laughs> so here's Brad. Hi, Brad Brad that, that my dad raves about. This is Brad. It's our friend's Brad's referral. <laughs> are, are, are we getting a piece of that? Which we really trust Brad, and he's a good guy, so. Hi. Well, well so, not just Dad, everybody raised Well, everyone. Brad. Wow, I mean, geez. there's he's probably not a nicer guy. person than Brad, but he didn't sponsor the video. I did not sponsor the video. I guess we've been in Colorado for an entire week, and our moving truck is finally arriving today. So in 35 minutes, this place is gonna start to get filled out with some of our stuff. Um, what the fuck is happening? What is happening? Oh my God. Ah. <laughs> and then I, my phone goes, ah, and I look and it says tornado warning in your area. Get to basement, get to shelter fast. And I'm like, oh my God. I locked myself out. How did this happen? Oh my God. Oh my God. Then the previous owner of the house texts me and goes, hey, I know you're not from here, but you need to get to the basement. And I was like, uh, and then he sent me a map and our neighborhood was like, on a scale of yellow to red, our neighborhood was like black. Like that's how red it was. It was literally like the deepest red ever. And then I'm freaking out. I call, he calls me and he's like, hey, what's going on? I'm like, I'm locked out of my house. I don't know what to do. Is there a shelter in the barn? Like I can't, I, had, I need to get the animals. And then I said, should I break a window? And he's like, let me look at the map again. And he goes, honestly, yeah. Okay, this is officially not funny anymore. Rylan's at the store. He's coming back home. There was a fucking tornado warning. I just got a thing on my phone. I'm having people in the area text me, telling me I need to get the basement. I'm fucking locked out. I've never had a tornado warning in my life. I don't know what that means. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. And then you called me and you were like, calm down. It's fine. And then bang, we get another alert and it's like the tornado is closer. Yeah. It was... I'm just trying to figure out, should I just pack my car and go to your house for a second? I mean